Hello, everyone. I am Troy Dawson. I am the chair for the alternative, uh, CentOS Alternative Images SIG, one of the hardest SIGs to pronounce, and uh, one with the most confusing uh, initials. We are not doing AI, but that is our initials. Um, what do we do? Uh, people want different images for CentOS Stream. Uh, being on the CentOS Stream team, I'll, the only image I give you is that big eight to 10 gigabit installation DVD or the little, it's almost two gigabits now, network install DVD, which in my day, that was the whole distribution. Um, actually, it's still my day, it's okay. Anyway, so we're, we're making the different images. Uh, and whenever possible, and thus far, we've always, it's always been possible, we're making them on the, the CentOS SIG um, infrastructure. So we're not building them on somebody else's laptop and uploading them. We're doing like real official stuff. So what have we been up to? This last thing, since our last uh, CentOS Connect, has actually been a fairly big thing. Uh, we'd, we'd had a problem with install uh, things. You'd install it and they wouldn't boot for over a year. So it was been over a long time. Um, we finally got that bug fixed. Uh, and we now officially have some images. We have a KDE image and we have a GNOME image, live image that you can install. Don't use the GNOME one. Use the KDE one, and I'm not just saying that because <laughs> because I like KDE better. See that other bullet point. There is some bugs. Uh, GNOME has a bug. Sorry about that. <laughs> uh, if you do find bugs, anyway, these they are usable. They are actually work really good. Um, I, I could tell you the GNOME one, but ask me later and we'll, we'll get it fixed soon. Uh, if you do have bugs, we have the URL there. I'm not gonna read it to you. Um, let's see. Yeah, it's been, sorry, but I, I, I'm just excited. This is the first conference or meeting or anything that I've been able to say, we have an image. And it's, it's been, <laughs> I, it's been uh, two years. Anyway, it's been a long time. So, oh, oh, other progress. We moved from IRC to Matrix. Um, sorry for you guys that like IRC. I still hang out there if you want to, but I haven't seen anybody say anything. We've also changed our monthly meetings from IRC to Matrix, and um, it's, that's just what's happening. So in our future, what do we see in the future? Now that we have images that we can make and do it, we are going to have regular updates. The updates, uh, we've had our discussion, we're going to do them a minimum of quarterly. Uh, currently that will be me running a script that builds all the images we do. Uh, we hope to automate it soon, six months, a year. Hey, it took us two years to get this far. I can wait six months for, for automation. If there is major bugs, you know, heart bleed, that sort of thing, we certainly will, you know, do images faster, but a minimum of quarterly. Uh, our documentation, we're also, now that we've got things set up, we're gonna document how you guys can, or can contribute, uh, get your own image built, um, right now we have GNOME KDE. I personally want to do a minimum one, which is something just bare. I tried IceWM, that didn't work very well, but um, something bare as well as a maximum. Every desktop in that we can put on CentOS Stream 9 will go in. Uh, sorry, Fabian, I know that's gonna take a lot of space. <laughs> okay. I, I might just do it for x86-64. Maybe that'll save a little space. Um, what? <laughs> 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 
No, we're not doing, you said S390, right? Yes, we are not doing S390. Um, yeah. As, you guys aren't hearing the comments, we're hearing, I don't get paid enough to do that. Okay, documentation, we're gonna document so that you guys can, so other people can contribute, so it's just not the Troy and Neil show. Um, and uh, we talked a little bit about this last time. If there is a image build infrastructure that you want, that's your favorite, currently we're using Kiwi. Um, bring it to us, we'll, we'll see. Um, we've tried several and they didn't, were, weren't very good fits for the, the SIG infrastructure, but bring them to us uh, and, and we'll see them, we'll try, we'll work with Fabian um, and, and we'll see, because who knows? You, got, you might have a better image builder or, or a different one that works good. I'm going to be short, which is, which is good, but uh, I still have five minutes for questions and answers. I have one in the back. We've got a microphone coming to you, Christian. Hi, everybody. I'm Christian. I'm the co-lead uh, co of the cloud, SIG. Okay. And we're producing images there, too. Um, and I was wondering whether we could kind of uh, move that image distribution uh, part of, of our work uh, over to the ALT images, uh, SIG. We currently, um, well, we do RPM OS tree-based images, um, which is probably something you, you don't currently have. Would, would that be a thing? Like, would you be interested in, in helping us with that, or could could we? Are there any synergies you you, you could see, or um, yeah, I, I'm just wondering whether we could come. Yes, up let me let me answer real quick. Yes. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> come and come see me and, and or Neil uh, Devada is is also one of the good ones. Yes, we'd love to work with that. So, yeah, w because currently we we build CentOS Stream CoreOS, aka SCOS. And so we only upload it into an S3 bucket and that's it. And we don't really uh, do anything else with it. And one, one of the questions we have is, are you building it someplace else or are you so able to- Currently it, it runs on an OpenShift or OKD cluster uh, in a Tecton pipeline that wraps CoreOS assembler. So it's, it's quite, uh, quite an intricate quite, setup. Quite um, involved th there is a plan to move those image builds over to OS build or image builder, which I think uh, Red Hat supports as a product, and which we have in Fedora uh, as well. So uh, there's that. Th that hasn't happened yet, and I, I don't think the switch would make sense before that. That is happening, and it's supposed to happen this this year sometime. So there's going to be some changes, and maybe as part of those changes, we, we can kind of work together. But I think that'd be awesome. Yes, I think so too. And then we could get you into our regular automated stuff. Um, yeah, let's. Let's talk together, work together, and see what we can do. Um, I, I always keep looking over at Fabian because he's sort of the hardware infrastructure guy. Um, but yes, uh, definitely. What, what was your name? Christian, right? Okay. Okay, thank you. Uh, any other questions? Yes. And I should remember your name, but I forgot it. Uh, it's, uh, Dan? Oh, that wasn't even what I thought it was. <laughs> hey, uh, so just about the integration with the cloud sick, you can't build uh, OS3 images with Kiwi yet. With Kiwi, know. yeah, correct. It's not yet possible, but it's implementable. Uh, my actual question was about, do you use OpenQA for testing? Because then you should have seen that, uh, or then you could have seen that the installer is broken. Oh, it was really easy to see that the install was broken. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm sure it's easy to see, but if no one checks, then it, ga it oh. passes by unnoticed. Currently, no. Uh, we would love to work with OpenQA, and I, 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 the integration good, so. stack, I'm sorry I missed that one. I, I had to choose between all of, anyway. 
Um, currently, no. Would we like to? Yes. So, yeah. Any more questions in the room? Let me check the live stream quickly. Okay. Got like two minutes. I'm actually on time. Now, granted, I had four slides. So I think some of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, looks like there are no questions in the live stream, so thank you, Troy. All right, thank you.